Hi, I'm Steve Superfan here. Uh, back again. Uh, sorry for the glare in my glasses. It's really bad this time. Um, this is a video. I'll try and lift forward and look downwards. <laughs> this is a video of uh, a new mask I got from Mex Masks from EB. I really suggest you uh, check it out. Um, I've just shown it off to a few people on MSN, but. Uh, probably guessed it already by the amount of horns no it's not psychosis it's uh, the person who psychosis uh, sort of tribute mask he used a tribute sort of to him it's a uh, Jushin Li Grey uh, you, you can see my mouth hey hello uh, no glare I should do my videos with this more often and yes the glasses are still on underneath so if I take these off Pull the mask tight and see what it actually is. More of what it should look like when it's proper on. Oh, there you are. Very well, tight, but not too tight. It has this horn piece coming up here. Uh, and it has all the horns and it has the uh, tabs kind of the eye piece, which is pretty cool. And it has the gold teeth on the front. And the red is different from this red. Obviously, because this is the red for his lips. And this is the red for his mask. Uh, if you've never heard of Jushin Li Grey before, I suggest you check him out on YouTube. Type in top 10 moves. Uh, he was a really great wrestler. Uh, he suffered a really bad uh, heart injury. I think he had a heart attack or something. Uh, or he had an operation. I can't remember. I'm sure it had something to do with his heart. Uh, I've just lost my glasses now and can't see. Uh, but I'm sure it has something to do with his heart. But uh, he came back, it was only like 25 or something when he had this uh, heart injury. And uh, now I've messed the camera up. <laughs> it was, uh, he was only young when he had this heart injury. And he came back, and I think his first match from injury coming back, he faced Rey Mysterio. And uh, Rey won that, I think. Or was this his first American one? I can't remember. It was quite a long time ago. But uh, Justin Lee Gray, most famously in America or UK from WCW. He did uh, four appearances. Uh, two were four. One was a fall brawl. Uh, one was the hog, wild hogs thing. One was just WCW Thunder, and the other was Halloween Havoc. I think, if I remember correctly. But uh, he was a fantastic wrestler, and he is really big in Japan, like huge. Obviously not Ultimate Dragon style, but uh, not far off. But uh, I really suggest you go check out Mex Masks on eBay. I will put a link in his description. Uh, he actually makes these masks himself. Now, I didn't realize this. I thought he just imported them or bought them and sold them on eBay. But he actually he actually makes these masks himself. So all this detailing, he actually does all this. Uh, I have got him to make me a custom mask. Now, he might do one for you, but I think you would have to ask very nicely. Um, this is my third one, I think, from him. Uh, if not, I'll put in a description. I'll do an edit. But me, the masks I've got from him are La Parker, Psychosis, and the. It's just gone. <laughs> Jushin Ligri, uh, or Ju Justin, Justin Ligri, or Lega. You know, there's very different. It's all the same person, but the WCW changed his name, how they said it, and stuff like that. Really stupid. <laughs> But uh, check his website, Mex Masks. The link right down there. Click on that. Uh, if you live in the UK, his uh, masks are twelve pounds, sort of thirteen pounds for the ones that he has up there. There's some prices that are higher, some are lower. It depends on which mask you're going for. Uh, he does do uh, bid ones as well. If you're not into buying it now and you fancy it, and get a quick deal. Uh, but I don't suggest doing bids. I really hate bids on eBay. It really, really ticks me off because I get really, really excited and then the last second bang someone else has got it and it really does my head in but uh, I'm really blabbering on now um, the next masks I'm after from Mex Masks are a Ultimate Dragon, Ultimo Dragon uh, Tiger Mask I or one and uh, my custom one obviously and uh, a Curry Man cause Curry Man is just epic uh, if he ever does put a Shark Boy up I will probably get that as well uh, depending if it's the Indie or the TNA one I did prefer his TNA mask, slightly different, you know, with the uh, the holes in the blue, you know, like certain areas had the fishnet type stuff in. 
but I mean any shop or mass really too, there's not really much that to do. Uh, but Mr. You Superfan, uh, giving a quick shout out to Anne Marie McInnes. Uh, I'll put a link on her file as well, her, for her YouTube. Uh, go check her out, she's going to be doing an awesome vid soon. Uh, kind of wait for her to reply to this before I uh, say something I don't really need to say <coughs> excuse me um, before she, until she replies um, I'm also uh, I explain what my custom mask is it's a full-on black mask and then it has the marks up here like Rey Mysterious Falcons but they're like green tears into it so it's like torn in so someone scratched my face sort of thing uh, Tal has a little skull here, if I remember right, in a cancer pin inside the skull. Um, and then it's going to have a Laparca style hood, black, with the green triangles going round. Uh, it'll not have the sort of, you know, like the blown out brains part, the piece coming out here. But on the back, it'll have a, uh, a cancer pin for the non Hodgkin's lymphoma cancer pin. That's why it's in black and green, uh, green being for the non Hodgkin's lymphoma. And uh, she replied, um, yeah, sure, go ahead. Uh, she's going to be doing a video for the Royal Rumble preview. She's going to do a preview vid. I've seen quite a few on the internet at the minute. Um, can't wait to see her opinion on what she thinks is going to happen. Um, but that's pretty much it. Mr. You Super Fan, sign out. Subscribe, rate, uh, comment, do all of it if you want. Don't if you don't want to. Uh, Mr. You Super Fan, sign out. Bye.